Your hormones are talking to you, right? How many times have we blamed our hormones for how we're feeling or how we responded to somebody or why we're tired? All the things, right, we blame our hormones for. Well, here's the deal. Those little hormones of yours, they're just messengers. They are trying to get your attention because something else is going on in your body. And we often, because we live such high stress lives, we ignore these things because we don't have time to deal with them, right? They're, they're just not things we want, we're ready to deal with, or we don't really have time to deal with them. And we're trying to push, push, push to get through things that we got to get done. And, but here's the thing, the more you ignore those hormones, the louder they get. And then other things start communicating with your hormones, like your appetite, your mood, your energy, your sleep, your just outlook on life changes, all because we didn't take those initial signals from your hormones and figure out what your body was actually asking for. Now you have all kinds of hormones in your body, right? They're not just the reproductive ones. They're not your estrogen going up and down. You have all kinds of hormones. So any number of things could be associated with why you're having hormonal imbalances and why your hormones feel like they're bouncing off the walls or they're not doing what they need to be doing. Getting to the root cause of that allows you to provide the real support that your body's asking for. And remarkably, those hormones calm down and they start going back to what they need to be doing in life. So, but here's the problem. A lot of us, you have things like birth control and hormone replacement therapy and all the medications that try to address it on a hormonal level. And sometimes those are needed, right? But unless we've really have also done the work to understand why our hormones are even talking to us, then all those medications are doing is just kind of blocking. They're blocking the hormones from talking to you. It's like putting up a wall and saying hormones are hitting it, right? And you can't hear it because the medication is blocking it. So again, sometimes we need the medication to help deal with bigger, so severe situations. And medical doctors know that very well. But until we do the work and understand why our hormones are doing what they're doing, then all we're doing is creating that wall. And this is where what you get with a holistic health practitioner like myself is we actually dig into it. And yep, you may still end up with the medication and that referral to your doctor to say, hey, I need some help with my hormones. But if you can do the other work and address those things, maybe that can be reduced, eliminated, um, and you feel better without the medications, without the extra things that are going on that cause that messaging to be out of whack. So our hormones really do try to talk to us. They are designed to talk to us. They're designed to tell us what our body is needing. They control things like our temperature and you know experiences and sensations and the butterflies in your belly. That's all hormonally driven. But if you don't understand what your hormones are saying to you, that's step one, right? And it's not just a matter of trying to shut them up. It's a matter of trying to get your body the support it needs so, because your hormones will naturally rebalance and go and do the things that they're supposed to be doing. But when they start kind of getting all crazy, that tells you there's something else going on here. And addressing that is going to give you much more long term relief and support and feel better than just blocking them and trying to hush them. So it, I do help people do this, and it's really interesting the things that come up when we start looking at hormonal imbalances in men and women, and understanding how things like our diet is influencing that, how much water we're taking, how our sleep is impacted, because your hormones have a lot to do with those things too. To work with me on hormon, hormonal balancing, you can reach out to me at dragonspitapothecary.com setting up that holistic health consultation, and we can dig into what your hormones are saying to you.